blackboard. Not just a piece of slate hanging on the wall collecting chalk dust. Not the name of the world's most boring pirate. It has something to do with classes at Lakeland, and you'll probably need to use it at some point. So, here are eight things you need to know about Blackboard at Lakeland. Number one, what is Blackboard? Blackboard is your virtual classroom where you can access course material and assignments online. And it's not just for remote classes. Many face-to-face -face classes use Blackboard as well. Blackboard is designed for an internet browser like Chrome or Firefox, but there's also a mobile app. Find it in your app store. Number two, how to get to Blackboard. There are a bunch of ways to get to Blackboard, but we recommend getting there from your My Lakeland account. Log in at my.lakelandcc.edu and click the Blackboard link on the left. Once you're in, you're brought to a page with a lot of stuff. All of it's good information, but BB Help, Student FAQ, and My Courses are the areas you need to know first. Every new student is enrolled in the optional Student Orientation to Blackboard course. You can practice using Blackboard and not worry about hurting your grades or exploding the internet. Number three, getting help. Maybe the most important thing to know about Blackboard is that there's a lot of help available. From the student FAQ and BB help, to the resources at Lakeland's Help Desk and Learning Center, we want to make sure you can focus on your classes and not deal with website drama. If it's the first week of class and you can't get into Blackboard, call the help desk right now. Number four, the syllabus, AKA the rules of the game. The course syllabus is the roadmap to the semester and almost every course in Blackboard will have it posted. Click the syllabus link and save it to your device. Read it carefully and put the due dates in your calendar. Refer to the syllabus throughout the semester to make sure you're on track. Number five, course content, assignments, and discussion forums. These are the meat and potatoes of the virtual classroom, or kale and hummus if you're into that, I guess. Explore your course in detail because every instructor uses the software a little differently. Many classes use the discussion forum as a place to ask questions and respond to topics brought up by your instructor or classmates. If your class uses the discussion forum for credit, it will be in your syllabus. Number six, submitting your assignments. Knowing how to submit your assignments properly is kind of a big deal if you care about things like, you know, grades. Start by clicking the link to the assignment. Make sure you've met the instructor's directions and click the button in the Attach File section. And most importantly, click the big Hard to Miss Submit button at the bottom right. You'll know it worked because you see the file right there on your screen and you'll get an email receipt. Number seven, your grades. How you're doing in class matters. So check your grades to make sure you're not caught with an unpleasant surprise at the end of the semester. Click the My Grades link and you'll be able to see assignments you've submitted and coursework that's already been graded. Some assignments may have a balloon next to it, which means your instructor has given you some feedback. To view it, click the word balloon. Number eight, check in often. Your classes are alive. Not in that cool Frankenstein's monster kind of way, but things change in the course throughout the semester. Be sure to drop in on your class a few times a week to see if your instructor has posted updates or your classmates have added anything new to the discussion forum. So there are eight things you need to know about Blackboard at Lakeland. Did we miss anything? Tell us something you wished you knew before using Blackboard for the first time or suggest another things you need to know video you'd like us to create. We'll see you next time.